been a while since I've made videos. That's because I don't know what to talk about. Some people have different topics to talk about all the time. Um, I really don't. And then, since I got the most boring off days, Monday and Tuesdays, it's not that really, it's not really that many events that's going on. So, you know, that's another reason why I don't videotape as much anymore like I used to do. Like in, like in 2010, 2012 and stuff. Oh, that was 10 years ago. I can't believe I got video footage of 10 years ago on here. Oh, I had, um, do not, I went to Ivy Rose, do not go to IvyRose.com because that's a gimmick site. They have an American address and they have the photos, those clothes looking good, looking hot and stuff. And, and then the, the clothes is really shipped from China and when you get it back, it looks so cheap. This is the dress that I ordered right here. Let me see. That's not it. I mean, hold on. Let me get it. Trying to look for it. Mm. Okay, here it is. Right here. Now you see this. The thickness of the material is layered in the middle. It's layered, you know, it's layered in the middle. And it looked more expensive. It looked more expensive looking. Now this is what I got. This is what they sent me. This old cheap piece of junk. Here's the dress right here. Hold on. Here's the dress right here. This is what it really looked like. Piece of junk. Look how cheap it is. Look how you can see through the, uh, look how you can see my hand through the light and stuff. You better not get caught in the rain in this damn thing. You can see right through this damn thing. It's like one of them um, country share cropper dresses from like Little House on the Prairie or the color purple or something. That cheap ass piece of shit. That damn thing I paid about $32 if you include shipping and handling. $32 for this rag. <coughs> it looked like something from the damn color purple or something. One of them old time movies where everybody country in the backwoods, barefooted swatting flies, like you be wearing one of these dresses. Oh, you milk the cow, Bessie? I milked it, Paul. I milked the cow. Or oh, one of them uh, segregation movies, some slave movie. Master gonna get you. He gonna get you. Don't get me, Master. That's what it looked like. One of them damn dresses. These dresses. This dress is cheap. And Ivy Rose clothes on there. Those pictures are fake. They make it look like that. Those clothes are gonna be so good looking. Or those dresses are gonna be so expensive looking. The material gonna be thicker. And this is a large. It's like a ten year old can wear that. That's supposed to be a large. You know when you order stuff from China. I didn't. I thought it was an American one. So if you, no, it was extra large that I sent. That I, this is a large, but they sent me the wrong size anyway. It's supposed to be extra large, but it wouldn't have made a difference because it's so small. You know when you ordering clothes from China, you got to get an extra, 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 extra large. If you like a size ten, yo, your ass got to get about like a size twenty two. If you a size like four, your ass got to get like a size fourteen with China clothes. These things cheap, so don't go on IvyRose.com. That is a scam site, scam. And I wish I would have read the consumer websites about it. It's so many negative stuff about IvyRose.com. So many negative stuff about them. The same thing I was saying about how cheap it is and how long it takes to deliver. But mine didn't take long. It took like three weeks. Some people been waiting two, three months. So stay off that site. That site is a scam. Yeah, I don't know what else to talk about. Um, I have no idea what to talk about. Um, I was supposed to take some more professional pictures yesterday, but 
had to cancel that because the photographer is out of town until mid to late July. So that's going to have to be changed. I'm going to get some more pictures done because I can't believe I waited till <coughs> I can't believe it's been since um, 2018 since I had them because time just be flying. If I would have realized it would have been 2018, I would have took some last year. I didn't even I didn't even realize it. But I don't really like to take that. I don't I'm not really a picture person because you gotta take so many shots in each pose when you're taking professional pictures. I just like just get one, two snaps, okay we done. I love those type of pictures. That's all you do. I don't like doing all the um the professional like professional modeling style photos. I, I like the outcome of it, but the process Nope, I don't like it because <laughs> it takes too long. But I don't know what else to say.